Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a challenge that many developers encounter when working with Celery and Django. Our viewer asks how to dynamically add tasks to a Celery chain for sequential execution. Let's dive into the details. Welcome back to another technical video. We're gonna go through the question, the answer, and I hope that you get the solution. Guys, I hope you stay crazy just a little bit like me and work your way through to getting to that end resolution. Let's get started. To dynamically add tasks to a Celery chain, we need to rethink how we structure our tasks. Instead of using a static chain, we can utilize a list to hold our tasks and then create a chain from that list. First, let's define a function that retrieves the selected jobs from the database. This function will return a list of tasks that the user wants to execute sequentially. Next, we will create a function that constructs the Celery chain dynamically. We will use the chain function from Celery and pass in the tasks retrieved from our list. Finally, we can execute the chain. When the user selects jobs and starts the process, we will call our function to create and execute the chain, ensuring that tasks are processed one after the other. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To dynamically add tasks in Celery, use the link function instead of chain. This allows you to link tasks together easily. By linking tasks, you can iterate through them and add each task signature. Finally, call apply async to execute them. And that's it guys. We've gone through, found the solutions, and hopefully answered your query. If it did, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. And until next time, hope you have a good one. Cheers.